Welcome to Exo News TV. I'm Michael Sala. A 1968 photo taken during a lunar orbiter mission to the Moon shows what appears to be a spacecraft that is at least 10 miles long resting inside the crater Manilius. Most of the object is well illuminated by the Sun but the rest is in the shadows of the crater which is approximately 24 miles in diameter and 2 miles deep. What appears to be a spacecraft cockpit is in the shadows. What is even more compelling in the lunar orbiter photo is what appears to be a road that stretches across the entire horizontal width of the photo. The road can be estimated to be 120 miles long and as much as a mile wide. The road's width suggests that it was likely used to transport very large equipment and freight similar to open cut mining ventures in many countries or even moving large rockets as occurs at places like Cape Canaveral. The apparent spacecraft and roadway were photographed by Lunar Orbiter 3 that was sent in 1967 to map the Moon for future Apollo missions. One possible explanation of the object in the Manolais crater is that it is an optical illusion based on a depression in the crater rather than a large spacecraft resting on the crater's bottom. The contours of the object as it meets the shadow cast by the Sun from the crater's rim, however, appears to rule out such an explanation. Importantly, Another photo of the Manolis crater taken during the Apollo 17 mission again shows a long elliptical shaped object in the crater that is well illuminated by the sun. The Apollo 17 photo suggests that the object in the Manolis crater is not an optical illusion. The lunar highway is clearly not an optical illusion since a close up shows it to be a very straight depression spanning the entire photograph's width. Using the diameter of the crater Manolis as the reference, the road can be estimated to be much longer than the 120 miles length of the portion in the photo. Lunar dust covers the surface of what appears to once have been a major road used for transporting very large cargoes. The apparent road is surprisingly straight, suggesting it is not a natural depression. The object captured by the Lunar Orbiter 3 does appear to be a huge spacecraft that is at least 10 miles long resting on the bottom of the crater Manolis rather than an optical illusion from a depression in the crater. The possibility of artificial structures on the moon that is even harder to dismiss is what appears to be the remains of an ancient lunar roadway that is at least 120 miles long and a mile wide. This leads to the intriguing possibility that the roadway was once used to transport very large rockets such as that found in the crater Manolis to former launch facilities on the moon.